Han finds an open lane, and Oturu rejects him. Now Washington, no look. Oturu off the no look pass from Washington. The end of the floor. Here we see it, Isaiah Washington. This is your State Farm assist of the game. That's the great lane. Good body, good defender, but showing off that he can knock down a three there. Johnson the block, but threw it away to Oturu. Freshman out of Wisconsin. Madison, 14 points per game. Here's Martin, rejected by Oturu. Murphy double team. Nice, nice pass, pass Oturu. Thank you. Good job by Murphy. With that right thumb still tape, gives to Murphy in the short corner. Jordan on the penetration, passes down low to Oturu. Reverse layup good, and a foul. Assist for Murphy, bucket Oturu. The big passing, we've seen it all year, and hopefully and expect to see it as this season progresses. It's a shot by Oturu, no good. Rebound to Eaton. He wants to go coast to coast against Washington. Oh, no, Oturu sending the ball into the stands on the block. Is finished, 1-0 Minnesota. In here for Oturu and a big dunk from Jordan Murphy with a beautiful feed. He just got the better of him on that play. Oturu works along the glass, gets it off of it and in. The three well in the first half, second half, only one of five. Lock gets back in. I guess that was a shot. Oturu with a huge block. Shot clock did reset. Eight on the shot clock. Gabe Kalsher, no breathing room. Oturu inside. Count the bucket and a foul. Offensive end. It's Purdue beyond anybody else. In terms of how they started the season. Isaiah Washington out there for the Gophers now. Zigzagging his way to the other end. Oturu gets a great feed and finish. That's what Isaiah Washington can do so long as he just makes the simple play. Here's the lob. Reavers got it down low and blocked by Oturu. Reavers got it back. Blocked again. I'm told. He also, on that possession for Minnesota, they just picked up the second foul against Winston, and now it's a 21 to 12 score. But the finish for Murphy, that was a very difficult catch in traffic. Here's Watson on the baseline, rejected by Oturu, and then kept in play by Coffey. Excellent play all around. And Coffey, a little bobble on his way. He wants to shoot, and it knocked away. Oturu has three on the shot clock. He decides to pull the trigger on his first three ever. ESPN's exclusive presentation of college basketball is presented by Five Hour Energy Shots. Get back to 100%. McBrayer, clock dwindling. Follow, did it get off? Yes, indeed. The officials say it does count for the moment. They are in Murphy's head. Harper just gave it to Coffey. Nice handle. Three on one. Arturo oh. hammers it home. Oh, and some of it has been spectacular like this play right here. Off in the step back. Arturo. Oh, That's a hammer. And Minnesota has got its largest lead of the ball game. And the freshman Arturo takes advantage. And right here, right place. The way Maryland's been defending and the way... Fernando and the guards have been playing. You got playing exceptionally your best basketball game. And there was too many turnovers and cold shooting, which did him in. And his Providence days or his FIU days or his Providence diaper Providence. days. Uh, <laughs> diaper as well. <laughs> no diaper needed there. A little lingerie. Grab the entire baseline and was able to find the open man. But on the other end, O'Toole runs the floor. He is fouled. Chance in a three-point play for the Gophers. Shot by Manning all the way around of blocking out Oturu. Harmon with the take. He blocked by Oturu. It will stay with Oklahoma, but a great effort by the big man Oturu. Come by from both teams, and here's a big reason why Oturu running the floor extremely well. Oturu fighting through Manning and two others to get that one to go off the glass. Oturu took it away from Manic. Carr steps back and drops down the three. Just under a minute. Nine point game. Oturu got it. Count it. Fouled. Roll and throw in. Christian David's not going to win that meeting at the rim. And so you cannot foul for a three point play. 
But that's up that third. Maracha gets low enough and he gets that low at 73% from the field. He's going to make that. Trey Williams, great pass down low to Oturu. You'll see here, Trey Williams, a freshman, feeds Oturu. The sophomore's like, I'm glad I'm out here. He is short. He should continue to shoot that shot because he's capable of this good look by Marcus Powell. And now rejected. In the togetherness, togetherness of this team. After two years at Kansas, Moore eligible, playing in his hometown of Chicago. There's Oturu underneath his first basket. Nice job running Marcus Carr off the line. Nice contest. Willis down and out. Exceptional defense. And the follow, there's Oturu. We, we, you and I talked about this today. Daniel Oturu needs 22 touches tonight. Inside. In the second round. He goes to the bucket and the foul. Down the three ball, which is why it's dangerous when he's got the ball out there. And there's the drive and the finish. Far, Daniel Oturu is doing a nice job of not letting Luca Garza get deep post position. You push him off the block, you allow your help to come in, really making things tough right now on Garza. And how about that post move? You don't mind giving fouls if you're Florida International, but you certainly don't want to do it in that situation where there's nothing going toward the rim. Oturu oh. and one. He was patient. Look down glowingly. It would be. The flag up top of Kevin McHale, looking down. <laughs> Keep the foot down, the anchor there. Nice job by O'Toole. Up, a little bit of an under. But instead of the travel. Another cop, taking yeah. it to the basket. That was too easy for O'Toole. Kalsher. Nope. No. Short all the way. Offensive rebound, Demir finding O'Toole. And the foul on top. They're not able to corral it. So this not only is worth just the tangible points, but also as a team that's kind of struggling with their depth and their youth on the road, a chance for the and one when you had a chance, this is potentially. Now Demir against Castleton, no, but Oturu follows it up with a dunk. Right back at you though, Daniel Oturu hammering this one. Tour now spins on Davis and scores and a foul. And just able to keep his feet in play. And Alcar lob on Turo. Five. Here's Carr. Down low Tour on traffic and one. There wasn't much of a window, but Oturu so strong, flexing. Marcus Carr penetrates and challenged by Stevens, lost it. Here's Lundy. Oturu blocks it off the glass. And watch Oturu. He's measuring his steps the whole way. And if the, for the freshman Lundy to have any chance, Corey, he's got to put that shoulder right toward the rim. Oturu against Johnson and scores. And that's what he can do. Oturu, eight points so far, make nice. it ten. Good job of recognizing the size mismatch. Turned by Williams, Carr, Kalsher, and Oturu. The shot clock is at two, and a runner goes. Big shot by Oturu. Spartans have really struggled when falling behind early on the road. That is not the case today. And there's a turnover by Henry. Numbers three on two. You gotta convert this. You gotta convert it. Two on two. Oturu spinning around the whistle. Gets it to go and a chance for a three-point play. It's gonna be tough to stop. Here's what happens though. You gotta let sleeping dogs lie. You cannot talk to a guy like Daniel Oturu. See that? In the open floor, sprinting to get to Oturu. Oturu going to work and a whistle and buried it. Oh, one to four. Oturu kind of gets buried along the baseline, but watch how creative he is offensively. Spin. I know what you're saying, though. Our love. Oturu, wow! In the air, bumped and scored off the glass, and one chance for Daniel Oturu. Go ahead and smile, big fella. Heck of a play. Takes the bump, concentration. Eyes on the rim. Eyes never leave the rim, even though the contact is there. Oturu going right at Watkins. 
spinning and scoring. They clear out that side of the floor. Still can't find the range. And Garza had it knocked free. Good defense by Willis. Richard has done an outstanding job with this team. Wow. Carr, top shelf for Oturu. Collins said he brought him in because he loved his edge, his competitiveness, and his swagger. This guy with some swagger. Marcus oh, Carr and Oturu with the flush. And a hang on the rim for some panache. Jones to the offensive rebound. He's Jared Jones didn't go, he didn't do anything right there. He didn't go over for the block, and he didn't get a body on Oturu. And you hear it. Send it home. This time, drop pass for Oturu, another flush from the big shot fake. Because he has to close out and respect Gabe Kalsher's ability to shoot, finds a nice seam, and Oturu just finished ahead, and I think that pays dividends here tonight. Today. Louie goes to Barron, swatted away by Michael Hurt. Oturu's got it for the Gophers. Up by 23, they still want to push. Kalsher dials it up and hits. Potter will check in for the Badgers at the next whistle. The Reavers, he wasn't ready for that pass. And now Trice has a step on Oturu, and recovering and rejecting is the sophomore. Now for the bounce to Oturu against Thompson. If Oturu gets it going against the smaller race, Thompson just muscled it to the rim, and he draws the foul for a chance at a three-point play. Oturu is one you like, but I love that he's patient enough, and then a little drop step and finish through the defender, race Thompson. I love that. It's about being patient in the post. The one thing... Last time they dealt that they're going to bring the double team, but they're going to bring the digs and a lot more active with it, and that's what we saw. Turnover by Durham starts a run out. Willis a wild shot, but Oturu there for the two-hand flush. Five offensive rebounds, but you also got to give a lot of credit to the guys making the entry passes. And how about Oturu with a steal, trying to outrun Devontae Green with a rim and a one.